let me tell you a story of how it all began. How a dragon became the best friend of the magical Fixer Man. Beside a crystal waterfall, over a fairy bridge made of stone, smoke whispered from the chimney of the fixer man's curious home. A clever man who lived alone in mystic mountain wood, fixing things all day long, helping where he could. Bang, clang, ding, ching, fizz, whiz, pop were the sounds to be heard from the fixer man's workshop. One day, whilst at the river, a strange shape caught his eye, bobbing on the water, slowly floating by. It was round, it was twiggy, he caught it in his net. He saw it was a large nest, inside a speckled egg. Carefully he dried it, he kept it safe and warm, he lay it by the fireside in his cosy cabin home. The day it hatched he was so proud and also quite surprised. A beautiful baby dragon appeared with sparkling emerald eyes. A man cared for him and watched him grow and grow until he was much too big for the tiny cabin home. Dragon, now big and strong, flew farther day and night until at last. He flew past, the woods and out of sight. The fixer man was very sad when his dragon flew away. He looked at the empty nest where a speckled egg once lay. As a sad tear ran down his cheek, he heard a flapping sound. Dragon had returned to him, laying objects on the ground. toy, a wobbly wheel, a broken walking stick. Dragon had brought home objects for the fixer man to fix.
fixer man's eyes lit up, he took them to his cabin. Behind closed doors came the sound of banging and clanging. Bang, clang, ding, ching, fizz, whiz, pop. Clouds of rainbow coloured smoke puffed from the chimney top. his arms, objects shone like new, he gave them to the dragon, and off the dragon flew. Dragon returned the mended things to some very grateful fellows. Returning home for supper time, flame roasted marshmallows. People stared at their gifts, as good as new and gleaming. They were utterly delighted. Every face was beaming. Each object had a little card tied with a ribbon of red. On each card, a little note that very simply said, With love from the fixer man and my dear dragon friend, please let him know of broken toys and objects I can mend. So if your toys need fixing, and you think that no one can, look up, you might see a dragon flying to the fixer man.